or someone to We're talk back. Welcome. We're back. Since I was a child. <laughs> Quetzal's <laughs> interrogation. I have a proposal if you... This is before we get to the interrogation. Are we, we're there, right? Yeah, you're there. I, I didn't so mean we... to jam you up and get myself into this pickle, but it was self-defense. I, I have an idea. Just yes. just throwing an idea out there. What is your idea? I, I saw this notice in the tavern before all the shit happened mm -hmm. that there's some missing people and mm -hmm. the guild is looking for people to go find them. Yes. You want him out of this town, I'm guessing. We're considering that, yes. I mean... I'm not a bad person. He could. Uh, we could take him with us, with the understanding that he never returns to this town. Doesn't cause any more trouble. Okay. And he just comes with us. Give me a persuasion. Um, and then, as soon as he says that, I was like, I'll, I will vow to push him out of town. I'll Again, stay advantage. with him. How this goes first. Yeah. Huh? Do I get advantage with that? Uh, with the assist? Sure, yeah. Like, I'm just trying to chime in, like, I'll help him. I tackled him. He saw it. Wow. Is it bad? It's a nine and a six. Okay. Um, but yep. that's plus five, so 14. 14. That's not bad. 14 is indeed. Hmm. I mean, you don't have to clog up your prisons. You don't have to have this messy public ex execution. No town funds wasted. Wow. And I'm this... sure he's. I'm sure he'd be willing to chip in for her burial. Yes. So you. It was an accident. She accidentally fell on your fork? <laughs> <laughs> it was self-defense. It was the heat of the moment. We understand. The frying pan was in the fire. <laughs> we'll reduce it to mans uh, manslaughter, too. It'll only spend eight years in jail. We will... <laughs> Something you have to understand. The family of this woman is going to want justice. And they will probably try to get it through some means outside of us. That's a fair warning. Now we... Tavern brawls... Deaths happen at tavern brawls. Occasionally. It isn't something that happens with any degree of regularity, because most people don't use weapons. <laughs> I was just protecting the bar. If you would just get, what was, it, what was his name? Dan? We will relieve you of all of your weapons. He would just, if he would just shield. bring Dak in here, he could, he could protest, uh, attest to my character. Dak is dead. What? <laughs> <laughs> how, how has this happened? <laughs> You killed my boss. <laughs> He's my but character witness. <laughs> Damn. We were about to ask you the same thing. He was killed with a dagger. <coughs> One that <coughs> See, could have easily <coughs> been used <coughs> to prepare food or something That's along those lines. So it resembles a kitchen knife. As you can see, I have two daggers. We didn't think that you actually ended up killing him. I like the deck. It was a, a, paid a fair employer. <coughs> and my so only character have, witness. So you have no idea who did it. No, I saw him go into the kitchen and that's the last I saw of him. I see. Great. It was about the time I was getting okay. hit in the head with a ale bottle. This is what we're going to do. You will no longer be allowed to set foot in Piscian. If you do, your life is forfeit. Any weapons that you have, you will relinquish to us. Any weapons that I have? All of them. Uh, your 
fork, your any frying pans, spoons, whatever you have that you use as weapons, we are going to confiscate. My frying pan I used to cook with. These are my cooking. I'm a cook. I need these utensils for my for well, my you have to reacquire some. I'm just gonna go out of town and buy new ones. <laughs> and well, that's okay. We're taking them for now. Whatever you have here. We're also taking as a uh, penance, if you will, 100 of your white draka uh, to for the funeral and for other associated damages. I'd like to uh, file a lawsuit against the family of this woman. Oh, Jesus. Because she attacked me and injured me. Would you like for us to bring her family here? If she's allowed to attack me for no reason and I can't defend myself, what's the what's the, what's the justice? What's the point of this? She was not trying to kill you with a blunt. If you hit someone with a, a weapon, a blunt, even a blunt weapon could kill someone. Well, yes. It's not that she wasn't not trying to kill me. We don't have her intentions. Do you, do you want to, to, for us to bring her family to you? No, but I believe there should be some compromise. Such as? I'm happy to leave the town. And, and pay the 100 light penance, but I'd like to keep my utensils. These are my tools of trade. We're taking the fork. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll give up the fork. Give me a persuasion check with disadvantage. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> you can have, a, have the frying pan and a spoon. Can I just tell you that I fail? <laughs> no <laughs> sharp <laughs> edges. <sighs> That's a two. That's a, yeah, it's a two. Total. Two total. Great. I have a negative two. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, you're funny. No. <laughs> <laughs> and you see the guards, like, start taking all of your chef stuff. They don't take your spice pouch, because that's not a weapon, per se. <clears throat> um, but they do take... All of the the cooking utensils that you have now, you'll have to reacquire some somewhere along the way. And all of you, the guard looks around, will uh, escort him out. Definitely. Okay. Very good. Art uh, Kane, where are you? Are you here? Are you with? The rest of these people? No, I've been chilling with the uh, Penumbra. <laughs> oh, I may have heard some. Yeah. Or have, they About there was another hey, murder that news night. Go check this out for us. That's type fair. of thing. News ju does trickle through that the uh, the avian is being questioned at the moment, and the verdict is still out. Um, <clears throat> if she had killed me, would she be put, put through the scrutiny? She probably would have been hung. With, with the bottle, if she had killed me? Even if it wasn't I'm intentional? Sure. Yeah. The fact that you have people vouching for you. But she also attacked me first. She did. Goodness. She did. This is racist. This is what she, she had. <laughs> She's tired of squawking. So, <laughs> well. Probably not. They don't. It, that, that's not relevant here. Um, you are, uh, Kane, you are requested to keep an eye on things and report to, to Penumbra. Because if, if this behavior continues, then they'll issue the warning. You know, kind of the about brotherhood, we know kind of thing. Uh, and then, you know, You'll be tasked to kill him, as far as that goes. So, all right. So, keep an eye out on him. Then, I've, it as I've been off on my way to the. So you're probably jail. outside the window or the yeah, like listening to jail. The you hear everything, but you're not there. Found a nice little nook. Yeah, you like sneak in and are like sitting in the dark corner. Of another cell. <laughs> you like picked it, locked it back, oh. walked in. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> You're sitting in a locked cell. Locked myself into the. Well, yeah, I put myself into the cell next to him. 
slumped over a pile of rags. Maybe with someone else. Just, like, the other guy didn't notice you come in. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so you hear all of what transpired, and they... Um, two, uh, two, two of the guard unchain you from the chair, and you are sort of forcefully lifted and moved out of the jail. Um, one of the guards looks into the cell the working is and is like, wait, what are you, we didn't arrest you. What are you doing here? Is, is it, why, is... why are you in? I'll just casually pull, pull like my shirt collar down to show him. Splash the nipple. <laughs> I see. You could probably um, just like walk up to the lock pick and just the guard, open it. Basically, the guard you see, um, like the eyes go wide a little, and there's kind of a nervous and then, swallow. And it has to do that. He he just nods, and uh, they continue sort of escorting the group <laughs> yeah. out of Fisian. <laughs> And we're at the outskirts of town. You are escorted out to the outskirts of town. Uh, Kane, are you are you kind of tagging along in the shadows? I'll, I'm going to uh, roundabout go ahead back to the out or the HQ place, mm -hmm. inform them of what, <coughs> what transpired, and then. No, we're gonna run back to us. I'm I'm going to main, uh, maintain contact with. Uh, to with this group to keep an eye on them. So, okay. So I'll check I'll check back in soon. Good. Uh, any you know, we have offices everywhere. So, mm. any just any other contracts that uh, come come in in the meantime? Mm, not yet. Okay. We'll let you know. Okay. We'll send you word. <coughs> and I'm off. <coughs> and you are off. Indeed. Uh, so the rest of you find yourself on the outskirts of Fissian. So you've taken a little bit of damage and are not feeling awesome. <laughs> I'm good. No, um, soon as we're. What time of day is it? At this point, it is around 9 o'clock. PM? PM. No, so the sun's <laughs> set or setting. Yeah. yeah. All right. As soon as we're on the outskirts of town, it's like, all right, guys. So we should make camp. Do you want to do it like right here? Probably get off the road. What? Probably get off the road. Well, yeah. No, we're not camping on <laughs> the road. I like that he can't understand you. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. No, you don't camp on a road. You camp in a soft, grassy spot. Maybe under a tree. There's a stream nearby. Great. But so it's it's late. We need to make camp. This is true. Okay. So I'm I'm gonna set up camp. I'm gonna walk a little off the path. Start a fire. Okay. And um, this is a kind of a plainsy area. There's not mm -hmm. a lot of trees. There are a few here and there. Yeah. No. I will. Um, if there's one, I'll go find one. And I wanna. I got a. I'm probably my about <clears throat> um, off 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 of the distance. Probably about, about ten minutes away, in the right direction toward uh, Isarod. Mm -hmm. um, there's a small copse of trees. So just walking out, looking around. I'm gonna look for some trees. It's a nice, comfortable spot, and I'm gonna walk to those. All right, guys, let's 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 go camp by those trees. It's a comfortable spot. All right. Yeah, it's, so it's, set up camp. it's about a hundred feet from the road, mm -hmm. um, kind of north of the road, and you can, it's, it seems relatively safe, you can definitely make camp there. You, do you set, like, a set a fire, or? Um, <clears throat> well, I have a, a camping kit as the Outlander, and I can help everyone set up well, a spot true. to sleep. Yeah. 
Um, Set up tents if you have them. You can just pull out bed rolls and that kind of thing. Um, if you if you do that. Uh, before we go to bed, I kind of walk off a little bit, a little ways. Just, you know, out of eyesight based. Try and get out of eyesight. You said it's Plainsy, but... Well, they're kind of setting up camp in the middle of the, of, of the copse of tree, so you could theoretically kind of shift around behind a, a tree. And... I'm not even trying to be stealthy, but I'm just walking away. You gotta pee? No. Um, it's gonna kind of kneel down and... <clears throat> start performing a ritual, like holding my blade. Okay. I, I picked up one of those warlock quirks from Xanathar's. Mm-hmm. And, uh, let me see what the exact wording on this is. Um, um, I did not take that one, but I'm still going to kind of thank my patron. Okay. Just try and, trying to cozy up to him. I just got this sort of a few weeks ago. <laughs> you did well not to kill I try not to. Good call. I don't know where I would have ended up if you'd been killed by the guard. Yes, I, d- I don't want to be killed. I just want to find Dalakos. <clears throat> Me too. And hopefully along the way find my brother and sister, but thank you, Dalakos. That works for me. Set up camp. I, I head back after about ten minutes. Yeah. Set up camp. Everything goes well. I'm not gonna make your roll for setting up camp. Well, I'm an outlander, so I can. I have to take the first watch. It's natural for me. Um. Okay. Uh, hang on. Give me just one. Second. I lost like no health during that fight, so. Yeah. I'll take first watch. Shit perception, but. <laughs> <laughs> How much time do we have? Seven minutes. Okay. Thirty-eight seconds. I'm right back. Okay. Will. Oh. I haven't got to do much yet. I've just talked my way into and out of things. Yeah. Which is kind of fun. I've never I, gotten to do that before. Your, uh, the fact that you can speak telekinetically, or telepathically, is a really interesting coincidence with my story. <sighs> this is fun. It is fun. I'm really, really excited for this campaign. I'm so glad I didn't go with that arcane archer. This is so much more of a fun character so, to play. So, no, well, all of us... Warlock. Warlock. Okay. Hexblade. All of us are melee attack characters. All of us want to be up on top of the enemies. Not really. Well, you are the only one that would be behind us. <laughs> Sorry. But you're not going to be about super far away. <laughs> this is crazy. I have range Pardon stuff. Me. Okay. Great. I like range. That's great. Sorry, you're the that, only range character It wasn't right too bad, I don't think. I'm... Uh, anyway, I'm probably going to be keeping my distance for. So you're not game. camping with us. Not right now. Yeah. Um, yeah. give me a stealth check, game. And a, a, anyone who would like to can make a perception check. This should be funny. To see what do I got? A minus two, minus okay. three. <laughs> <laughs> you're just not going to bother with it. Oh 13. no, it's perception. No, no, no. Yeah. I I can perceive. Thirteen. Thirteen. We found shit. No. <laughs> Go in the desert. <laughs> what? Twelve. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Cool. Roll. Uh, Quetzal. Yes. Did you roll perception? <clears throat> no, that was mine. I guess you should. Oh, I can't defend myself. I'm just going to sit and chill. Are you looking for the fire? <laughs> <laughs> the only way he can actually get to that 21 is, like, with a 19 or a 20. Oh, gotcha. Okay, yeah. None of you see uh, Kane. I keep wanting to say Psy. Yeah. I have to like think about it before I say Kane. It. I've called you Psy for three um, years. Both both are difficult to see. Psy <laughs> was a little bit better at it. 
But he was also Probably. 20th level by that time. And he's time. probably much better at it because it's been 100 years or so, yeah. give or take. And he's, no, You're he's your the own best boss. at it now. Oh. Oh my gosh, I, can't, I don't Pardon even want me. to think about what level he is at this point. Well, yeah, man, no, you, he is you are your own boss, though. See. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, you all do know, uh, I should have mentioned that before. We know who You the... do know that Psy... Is the guildmaster? Uh, is the guildmaster. Yeah, still. And we would know that Ulfgar is still the king. Yes, you would. And that Isaac Schmidt is his court bard. Fuck yeah. Because he's... The badass. He's Isaac Schmidt. He's, he's part of the family. He's an elf. He's going to live a super long time. Man, he does like them dwarven ladies. <laughs> and he does like... To... Are there a bunch of half-elf, half-dwarves in my fucking kingdom now? Uh, <laughs> I think so. A bunch of <laughs> show up that are a lot darker, or a lot more pale than the others. When most dwarves are stone. Well, yeah, I guess that's a different story. Stony people, because uh, we're going like. That's a lot of lube. Yeah. Well, <laughs> that's interesting. <laughs> uh, it, 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 Just to think, <laughs> it was stone. All right. I'm going to leave that one alone. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Nope. Anyway. Nope, nope, nope. All right. Who is on... Uh, let, let, let's talk about watch. I got first watch. Um. So, I'll ask you then. Are we in a hurry? Not as far as I know. Okay. Well... I mean, there's missing people. We might want to find them. It gets paid. I like money. Um, you said you said we started with 500 XP, right? So, as yes. soon as I set up camp, I'll tell you I'll take last I'm watch sorry, and had, pass out. I had to, to kind of deal with that. So wake me up. First watch. First watch. Anybody else doing the first watch? How many people are in the camp? Just four. The four of us. Four. four. Yeah. Okay. So is it gonna be four watches? I have no weapon. <laughs> and I can't see anything. Oh, well, that's you have true. no dark vision, do you? No. I have 120 feet that's of dark vision. True. Okay, so yeah. it's going to be crap. So I'm, I'm still. That's so all I can do. You're going to be second watch. Well, if he's the only one with the dark vision, then he probably should take the darkest hour watch. That's actually fair. Okay, so then you're not. I'll take second. Se take I'll take second or third watch. I'll second first watch. watch. Okay. Cool. Did the rest of you not have any dark vision? Nope, not human. Damn, Damn. dark vision with no weapons. <laughs> At least I'm useful. I can just oh, call. I can call people. Yeah. Krishna, first watch. Uh, give me serendipity roll, please. This is bad. So percentage? Yeah. Yes, percentage. 30. Oh, no, wait. Oh, three. Three. <laughs> three. Okay. Shit. Mm. No. It's okay. Yeah. You're good. Uh, first watch, nothing happens. Second watch, you. Me? Finn. Yeah, I'm taking the darkest part of the night. Finn, so, uh, give me percentile dice. Oh, not perception check? No, not perception check. I've got a fuck ton, man. So, I found a yeah. you go sleep in. Here you go. Somewhere. Yeah. 37. Maybe I had a hammock in my pack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me say that. I have, a, I have a hammock. Okay, huh? 37. 37, okay. Very good. Okay. No craziness. What you got? Wait, I don't like rolling with these. Hold on. Hold, please. Mm hmm. 79. Whoa. 79. Over 50. This is bad. It is. It is bad. All right. The end of the night. Shit. Kane, give me a perception check, please. At least I'm fully rested. Damn it. Oh, That's what it. I was trying to get to. Oh, that is going to be a... 25. 25. That's excellent. Um, you are awakened... By the sound of um, footfalls moving towards where 
the group is camped. And when you look out, you see a group of humans. Okay. They're making their way toward the group. The the tree cups. Uh, and they do appear to be armed. They're ready. To, like, attack. It's, Fuck it's, shit up. It's dark AF. Do they have torches? They're pissed. I'm gonna say not. not if they're trying to they have torches, but they're not lit right now. Or lanterns. Uh, now, it is 1040. Okay. Does everybody want to do some more? Yeah. Yeah, I'd like to keep playing. Like a, like weeks. All right. Let's go. 